celebrate their win. Some of the Celtics went to the Boys and Girls Club today, unveiling a new gym for kids. And as WBZ's Tiffany Chan shows us, they received a great reception. The kids at the Boys and Girls Club in Dorchester just couldn't contain their excitement. Getting a first look at their brand new basketball court with the help of Boston Celtics stars Al Horford, Derek White, and of course the team mascot, Lucky. Lucky signed it. Lucky? L Lucky's the good one and he did a lot of flips. If you could see on that hoop over there, he did a lot of flips on there and he was sweating really bad. I'm looking forward to getting going and getting a little movement, doing some activity. All the way down. Investing back into the community and these kids with new floors, backboards, safety equipment and signage. Thanks to the NBA Cares program and the Boston Celtics. What does it mean for you to see these kids light up and raise their hands and want to ask you a question? It's cute. It's, it's so special. I mean, you realize I think for everyone involved in professional sports, the ability to impact kids either directly through events like this or because they become motivated, stuff that Bill Walton did throughout his career, encouraging kids to dream big. And I am honored to stand before you to share the incredible impact that the Boys and Girls Club has had on my life. Kayla Collins has been coming to this Boys and Girls Club since she was 11, and now she works here. She knows how meaningful this gesture is. Someone had shown me that they cared and that um, they would get involved in like helping me achieve future things that made me want to go harder and stronger. A couple days before game two of the NBA Finals, spent giving back to the community. NBA from Dorchester, I'm Tiffany Chan, WBZ News. What